So, I had a wonder. I was looking at my lampshade and I thought, like, what if I just started laughing? What would that look like? Like a laughing lamp. A laughing lamp. How weird would that be? Hmm. So I think that in today's episode, we're going to draw just that and figure out what a laughing lamp would, would look like. <laughs> so grab something to draw with and something to color with and join me as we create this laughing lamp artwork. Let's make some art. This episode is brought to you by ArtasticKids.com. If you're a parent, guardian, homeschool family, or a classroom teacher looking for art lessons and resources, begin your journey by finding free art lessons, tips, advice, and more at ArtasticKids.com. All right, we are going to be creating a laughing lamp. Laughing lamp. Here we go, a laughing lamp starting at the top. We're gonna to do a straight line. And from there, two diagonal lines down. Nice and big. Lampshade first. Okay, from there we're gonna draw a straight line at the bottom. All right. Now, we gotta do a base, so we're gonna draw a rectangle at the bottom. Oh, my rectangle got crazy, guys. Do your best job at drawing a straight line. Don't get worried if your lines are not perfect. The more you practice drawing straight lines, the better. So we're gonna just do a base, we're gonna do a narrow rectangle at the very bottom. Just practice your straight lines without using a ruler. It's totally fine, you'll get so good at the end of this. All right, two more straight lines. There we go, it's looking more lamp-like. Okay, you can have a little chain, so I'm gonna draw a pattern of line, circle, line, circle, line, circle, line, circle. That way somebody can pull it and turn it on. We're gonna add some little lines along the edges for some detail and texture on all parts. On the ground, we're gonna use hatching lines to add some shading so it doesn't look like it's floating in space. And you can also do that up one side of the rod that kind of holds it up. All right, we're gonna do some laughing eyes. So we're gonna draw one curving line on either side of the face. Then we're gonna draw a second curving line to make it look like a rainbow. Then you can go ahead and color in each one. Just like that. Yeah. We're gonna draw the tears kind of splooshing outwards. So we're gonna draw a nice big curving tear shape. And we want more because it's Laughing so hard that it's crying. Maybe we have one tear drop splashing down here into a puddle because it's been crying for so long. There's now a puddle down here. All right, we don't want it to look sad, so we gotta give it a smiley. So between the eyes, we're gonna draw a straight line. And then we're gonna connect that line with the letter U. Inside the letter U, we're going to draw a letter M for a tongue. We can add some expressive lines around the eyes and the mouth. Underneath each eye, we're gonna draw a little oval for a cheek. And then you can go ahead and color in the dark of the mouth, leaving the tongue and those cheeks nice and white. Wonderful, M. 
And once you're done, you are ready to color in your lamp with your choice of colors. And start making mediums. Once you're done coloring in your laughing lamp, your laughing lamp is done.